Hi, welcome to Life with Steph Beth, and today I may have finally broken Shein because this time I literally have a box to unbox. It's an actual box they sent me this time. They usually send me a bag with DHL or something like that, and they literally had an entire box to shuffle of things. I might have a problem. <laughs> So let's get into it. This haul I focused a lot on t-shirts and tops type stuff that I could wear with the skirts that I got, some skirts I already have, and just in general because I'm, I don't know, I just wanted, I wanted some more shirts that were like just chill, simple, and would work with my varying colors of hair that, because I have some cool shirts and stuff that just don't always work so well with the hair, or they're like really I don't know, they have a lot going on with them and it's just, it's a whole thing. Additionally, a lot of these were on sale at the time, so I was like, shoot. <laughs> Might be what happens a lot of the time when this stuff goes down. And if you haven't noticed, I love, I love merch things. And I actually made this, like, it is my design, but the people who made, like, someone else made the cap and embroidered it and stuff, like, through Teespring and stuff, but, like, it's my design, and I, I have a lot of merch and stuff, and a lot of people are like, wow, that's a bit excessive, Stephanie, and I'm just like, no, because I wanted it on a t-shirt, or I wanted it on a hat, and so I'm just making it available to you, too. Um, so all of that to say is some of these are just gonna be, like, little slogans or little sayings and stuff, which maybe I should really stop doing, but oh well, too bad. So this first one is the Plus Letter a Graphic Short Sleeve Tee. This one says Hope on it. See, like, I feel like, I feel like it's chill. Like, I feel like even with, even with the yellow, <laughs> like, I can wear my beanie, wear my Hope shirt. Like, Hope looks dope. I'm, never gonna stop. Basically, it's a t-shirt. I wouldn't be surprised if this is very similar to kind of the way that things go through like Teespring and other uh, places like that. It's just a t-shirt. Made of 65% cotton, 30% polyester, and 5% spandex. Another thing I focused on was sports bras because I need some more so I can have appropriate support while working out. I did not anticipate high support from them even if it said high support. I think most of these either didn't say or were like medium or whatever. I am not anticipating doing jumping jacks or running, okay? Like, do you see me? Do I look, do I look like that's gonna happen? But I did, I did want something. Last time I ordered a sports bra from Shein on sale and it was way too big, so I sized down by two sizes because it just kind of, it still goes by the general sizing. This is the Plus Mesh Panel Solid Sports Bra, retailing for $11. It does have a smell to it. This one has a smell to it. Usually I don't notice smells from Shein's clothes, but this one has a bit of a smell to it. You can see the mesh here and then it has these, yeah, these just stretch. They're not adjustable or anything. And it's got a little bit of a crisscross and mesh backing. <laughs> yeah, I don't like that smell. It does have padding and it is removable. It's 90% polyester and 10% elastane. And I'm really getting annoyed by how much this smells. I'm really beginning to wonder if because they were like all smushed in the box or something. I mean, they're in their individual bags like usual. If that's why there's like so much smell from it and like maybe it's just because normally the bag kind of breathes and it didn't for now. So maybe that's why I'm starting to smell more chemically stuff than normal because I normally don't. Either way, this next one is the Plus Polka Dot Knot Hem Button Through Blouse, retailing for $13. I just thought it was cute. I just, I couldn't help it. I just, it, it was cute. It was cute. And it was, it was cute. And I think it was on sale too. And it was cute. It's got little fluffer things on the side. It's got a nice collar. I don't know. I like me a collar, okay? I'm a little concerned about the weird stretch thing at the bottom, but hopefully that'll turn out okay. It's got the little tie thing at the bottom. <coughs> Whew. The smell is really starting to be annoying. This one is 100% polyester, so it's good that it's, it's the, this kind of sleeve, because that could get hot really fast. This next one is the Shein Plus Cuffed Batwing Sleeve Solid Tee, 
retailing for seven dollars. This is probably the closest I got to like just a plain nothing on it average looking tee but it does have the v-neck it does have like a what is that heathering maybe I always think it's called heathering I don't know that kind of fabric or whatever it looks nice and it had the rolled cuff and the rolled cuff this is looking so much more red in the screen for some reason um it's, it's definitely more burgundy in person but the rolled cuff thing on other shirts I've gotten just recently from Shein was really nice the way it fit so that was my hope somehow that rolled cuff meant that it would work for me this one is also 100% polyester this next one is another sports bra it's the plus solid crisscross back sports bra retailing for nine dollars it's got the crisscross back it's got kind of this mesh but like layered mesh kind of thing going on here on the whole thing it does have padding that is removable. It is removable. And it's got this cool crisscross thing in the back. Someone had mentioned that even if they don't feel it's supportive enough for a sports bra, that if they wore it with like a shirt with a low back or whatever, it'd be cute. And I was like, why did I never think of doing something like that? Because I'm always like, if it has a low back, my bra is going to look weird and gross and nobody wants to see that. But if it's like a cute little design thing, it looks like you did it on purpose, you know? You know? Okay, anyway. So this one, these bras are definitely, are the ones with a lot of smell. This one I got in a 3X. This, not sure the reasoning on that one. It may have just not been available in a 2X. Or people were saying to size up. This next one is the Plus Cartoon Graphic Crew Neck Tee. Retailing at $10. Because it's really cute. It looks cute kitty cat. And he's reading with his glasses. <laughs> it, was, it was cute and I needed it. And it was on sale so i just like these a lot <laughs> i have a problem 65 percent cotton 30 percent polyester five percent spandex i have a funny feeling that these tees like this will pretty much all be the same but he's definitely like he has the whole thing printed on e too cute this next one is the plus contrast floral print sleeve tee retailing for eleven dollars and i feel like it's just kind of like you know uh an elevated t-shirt it does have a little bit of a weight to it but it's soft and it has a tiny like the stretch kind of feel to it this right here um probably polyester i'm gonna go for it lots of poly it's always poly when i'm confused might be some cotton in there too i feel like maybe for the main part of the shirt well i'm a genius because it's 100 percent cotton blends <laughs> but i figured that'd be a nice like black but like has like the upgraded little sleeve thing so it's cute but like it'll go with whatever random hair color I end up with and I just I like I like the idea this next one is the plus high support letter tape crisscross sports bra retailing for $13 now this one I don't know if I should have uh, sized down as far in because um I just I don't know how that's gonna go I'm just saying um, but it's got love letter tape is what that would be, which is the stretchy part that goes crisscross across the back. Um, yeah, like all of the sports bras have that strong chemical smell. I don't know why. They have the padding that is removable. It has this kind of mesh white on the inside and this flat uh, soft on the outside. This one is 86% polyester and 14% elastane. This next item is the Plus Double V-Cut Polka Dot Jumpsuit, retailing for $18. I don't know. I've just been seeing some people with cute jumpsuits, and I was like, that one's cute, and it's on sale, so I figure I'll try it. I don't know how we're gonna work out, though. So, of course, we've got the polka dot. Love it. Um, then we have, like, this connection of course not a very defined it's just it's there you got some stretch to the connection between it and the pants and the pants are like linen-y feeling and I don't like that feeling they're not quite a linen but they are thin um that's concerning <laughs> so I guess just um wear the same colored underwear or nude underwear with that We'll see if I'm even the right height to handle these. 
And this one is 100% nylon. This next one is the Plus Letter Graphic Cami Top with Tartan Plaid Pants Pajama Set. Retailing for $15. So this is the top. It's just, it is soft. I like that. It is soft. Now the bottoms are weirdly like that slick feeling on the outside and kind of on the inside. They're not as soft on the inside, which is kind of disappointing. They're very bright yellow. I figured I needed some pajamas that were more summer. I have a lot of very warm pajama pants and stuff for winter. This is 100% polyester, elastic band at the top. Pretty simple. A little bit of a a lettuce trim-esque looking thing trying to go on there. This next one is the Shein Plus Mock Neck Plaid Tee, retailing for six dollars. Now this is going to be a lot more fitted from what it looks like. It does, it has stretch to it. It does have that cute little mock neck and I just thought it would probably be really cute with like my black skirt I've gotten from Shein and I don't know, it was just different and I liked the idea of it. It's got kind of like the feeling of a lot of the dresses they have. It's a lot softer on the inside and it's like, it's not scratchy, it's just not soft on the outside. It is 95% polyester and 5% spandex. This next one is the Plus High Stretch Racer Back Sports Bra with Leggings, retailing for $22. So you just have a pretty much a plain black sports bra and like that don't bother me. It's got the racer back. It's got the smell. Now this one is a 4XL, so we'll see how well that works for me. It has padding, it's removable, got some stretch to the bottom band. It is 90% polyester, 10% spandex. They actually look like they might be decent. Now I prefer to work out in my house. Sometimes I go on walks and every now and then we actually go to an actual gym but that hasn't been happening for many years especially now with the rona and all that jazz so even if these are like a little thin or weird looking on me <laughs> not gonna be too com i won't complain unless if it bothers me like in a workout capacity honestly um or it just looks so ridiculous i just i'm not I'm, i'll send it back but anyway 90 percent polyester 10 percent spandex so that all came in one set. We'll see how the top and bottom, if they can handle working together on me. This next one is the Shein Plus Letter and Floral Top, retailing at $11. And basically it's just some flowers and it's a stay optimistic on a black tee. And yes, I'm dumb. I'm probably very dumb, but I don't care. I got it for a good price. It's cute. Hopefully it fits nice. If it doesn't, if all of these like fit terribly, I'm going to be very sad, honestly. And it is 95.2% polyester and 4.8% spandex. This last one is the Plus Slogan and Heart Print Tee, retailing for $11. I don't know, I have some things I have some things that would do well with yellow and it was just cute. Got some little hearts, says be mine on it. This one is 65% cotton, 30% polyester, and 5% spandex. Thank you so much for watching. I'll have the links to these in the description box. They're not affiliate links, etc, etc. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoy things like this, literally random stuff, Shein, hauls, trying out random stuff, etc. You can go ahead and hit that subscribe button if I'm going to upload for the week. It'll be Tuesday at 4 p.m. Central Standard Time. Bye!